In this video, I'm going to share with you the best cover three beater post patch in Madden 22. Now, EA Sports just patched Madden 22, and it was actually a fairly well received patch. A lot of people said that they enjoyed the patch. They liked some of the changes uh, to improve the cover three defense. The cover three defense does not get glitched out as well as it did in previous Maddens, but I am going to show you what I believe to be the best cover three bomb post patch, and it comes to us out of our bunch of tight end Seattle Seahawks offensive guide. So if you've not picked up the Seattle Seahawks offensive guide, I want to quickly remind you that you can do that by clicking the link in the description below. Also really quickly want to let you know about my true fan membership, my Patreon membership. That is just $10 a month and that literally gets you unlimited access to every offensive defensive ebook, every pro player breakdown, every exclusive tip, as well as a, uh, a private messaging platform where you can ask your questions to me directly. So uh, I would encourage you if you've not picked up that membership yet it's just ten dollars a month you can cancel it whenever you want i've got seven defensive guides i've got another one that i'm going to be releasing this week uh, and i think you guys are really going to like it and then i've also got three offensive guides i'm actually working on a fourth offense as we speak so that being said if you want to get the best uh guides in the madden community i would really encourage you to go over there check that stuff out we've got a lot of really good concepts and a lot of really good material for you for literally just 10 bucks a month and you can cancel whenever you want. So cover three, let's show you how to beat it. Uh, post patch, we are gonna go to PA boot over. Uh, PA boot over is certainly not as good as it used to be, but it is actually really, really well. So, or actually still really, really good. So um, the setup for this is simple. We're going to slide our line to the right. We're gonna block the tight end. We're going to then take the circle receiver. We're gonna put him on a slant and we're gonna put triangle on a uh, streak. And what you're gonna see is that this post route, we're just gonna roll out of the pocket and you're going to see here that this post route over the top is going to split that and typically will be able to get over top of pretty much any coverage in the game. Now, another thing that a lot of people I've noticed are wanting to do, especially um, with the post patch, and I think a lot of the meta is going to shift back to the Mike Woods 3 double Mabel meta, um, you, you will be able to see that they're going to baseline and press, and that's going to make this even more open uh, than it already was. As you can see right there, Godwin is consistently getting over the top of that outside third. Uh, which is what makes this so good. Now, the beauty of this is this wor this works on both hashes. That's another thing that I really like about this bomb is that you're going to oftentimes be able to do this uh, really no matter what. So you're going to see here, this is cover three. I just moved the ball to the other side of the field. Right here, Isaiah Simmons is going crazy. Um, good old big nickel over G. And this is what, that's actually the defense that I'm working on is going to give you guys some new concepts out of big nickel, which I think you guys are going to really enjoy. Uh, for the purpose of the video, I'm going to kind of just block that guy out. Uh, so that you can see this because the sheds and practice one are just so powerful. But anyways, you're going to see here again, there's cover three. And you'll see on this side, he actually plays it a little bit better. Um, but again, kind of what I was talking about in the beginning of the video. A lot of people like to press out of cover three. So if they like to press out of cover three, this is going to be like a thousand times more effective. Obviously, rolling out makes this significantly more effective. And as you can see right there, Brady just can't make a throw, but the route is wide open over the top. So if they press you out of cover three, to me, this is really consistent. Honestly, it's pretty consistent even if they don't, as long as you get out of the pocket. I think getting out of the pocket is really, really important. See how he kind of stutter steps and then doesn't really go back? And then as you can see right there, that thing is just torching the cover three. This is the best bomb in the game right now. I would really encourage you, if you've not learned the bunch tight end offense, to pick it up. There's a link in the description if you just want to get the bunch tight end guide. But my recommendation is for you to grab the Patreon. The Patreon is literally just 10 bucks a month. For just $10 a month, you unlock everything. Every ebook, every offensive guide, every defensive guide, as long as your subscription is active, you will get access to all of the materials. So I would really encourage you to head over to the Patreon. I'm going to link that down in the description below, and we'll see you guys next time.